Amika Williams and welcome to my DIY nail video. Hit like, hit subscribe, and share. I'm Miko Williams and welcome to my DIY nail channel where you will get to see my nail art and no I'm not a professional I'm doing it myself and I'm practicing and I'm just here to display the different types of nail designs that I created on my own or got inspired by other YouTube nail tech vloggers so right here you see nails that I actually did off camera because it would take too long to show step by step what I did for each one so what I did was I actually did the design offline and then actually finished them and came back to show you what it would look like so here you're seeing where I'm actually showing how the nails look with their base color before I even get started with any type of nail design and for what I'm seeing when you actually go on YouTube and watch other nail technicians that show you what to do and how to practice always make sure that you cure your nail with a top gel coat to always save your previous um, work so if you happen to make a mistake that you don't ruin the previous work that you've done on the nail using a top gel coat from what I understood actually is like a save point for each progress of your achievement when it comes to designing your nails so always use a top gel coat and cure it by putting it in the US the UV light. And I cure my nails about, you know, anywhere from 30 to 60 seconds. Here is a nail that I actually um, did and this is like purple with a little, you know, pizzazz of silver chrome to it. And here is the materials that I use to achieve this look. So you will see the little aluminum right there the um what do you call the rhinestones and then the base color from beetles and then for i think it's called um model one or model loan i keep pronouncing the name cor incorrect so correct me if i'm wrong but help me out the next one is this i call it the greek goddess you know this one here is one of my favorite creations very chic elegant but yet honey it says a huge statement so you see the materials here you see what i use also the base color is from beetles and then the same top coat gel and the actual aluminum which is gold so um i did use tweezers to pick up the aluminum and put it there this is my next one it is called the emperor you know it's like the, the emperor you know it's like going to war it, it reminds me of armor with a little bit of shininess silver chrome and diamonds you know you, you you're you're being dazzled by the dazzle and here you would see the rhinestone pack here that i got off from amazon this is what i created i came up with this creation and i also used the aluminum you know um little foil there and here are the base coat and the design coat and also the top gel coat and usually the nail gel that i'm using is by beetles which i'm becoming a fan of and no they're not sponsoring this uh video but i'm liking them here i done this before i call it my swirl marble lay you know it reminds me of like a, a a strawberry shortcake type of look and here are the colors that i use also 
and uh, it's a little tricky but I want to explain the first base color is 803 the design colors are on the side by Beatles and the design colors you can always stop the video to actually write down which design colors I use there are four different design colors the tip of the end of the edge at the bottom is the actual glitter that's also sitting with the with the design colors on the side and um, yeah I'll list everything in the description so you don't have to you know scratch your head to what I did I do apologize these are the brushes that I did use to swirl and move the colors around I did do a previous video that was a standalone video that actually showed in detail how I did it so you can always watch that to achieve that look and this one here you know you've seen this before um, I just happened to try it myself I need to really work on getting my lines down packed neat because I felt like I could have done better but you know hey it's a start but I like it you know my waterfall here are the colors and here are the brushes that I use to try to achieve the look and I will still practice and keep practicing so I can get much better so the lines can look much more neater and not raggedy and all over the place but um, I gave it a try anyway so here are the gels that the polish that I did use in the two brushes in the top coat and the top coat really helps you know save the style um, this is the finished result of each nail that I actually completed here are the base coats of what it looks the colors that I used to achieve the on the nail before I actually started to design each nail with all the glitter and glam and um, diamonds and foils and stuff like that these are the base coats so you want to write the base coats down in case you want to achieve these looks you can always pause the video, write down the information, and then try it yourself. Comment, like, tag, share, and also, you know, let me know how yours came out. I'm Miko Williams. I just wanted to tell you thank you for watching my DIY COVID-19 nails here in Los Angeles, California. And if you are a nail tech, you know I'm trying, so keep putting up them videos. Thanks for